Will Yes Go On? Well, we asked Billy Sherwood, their bassist. I'm John Bowden from Rocky Street Music. Obviously, the, the, the future of Yes, there's a time limit. Who knows what it is, probably, but there is a time limit because you can't cheat the hangman, as Patrick Simmons of the Doobie Brothers would say. Are you thinking ahead of that, or are you just going, I'm in Yes, I'm doing my solo project, this is my life, let's, let's let that roll? I'm thinking right now, I mean, we're, you know, we're really enjoying what we're doing. Our plan was to go out and play Relayer and, and, and carry on and get, get going again. So uh, the future is bright. I'm not really looking at the end so much. Um, you know, someone asked me once, do you think as you replace Chris, someone will replace you? And I said, I think it's going to be five robots that just nail this stuff down to the wall. <laughs> we'll just have to see where it goes. <laughs> I know it's too soon, it's premature, but I'll ask because a few fans asked me to ask you, uh, Arc of Life, is there a possibility in a perfect world that they would just open for Yes, if Yes goes back out? Um, you know, you never know how things work. I mean, Asia opened for Yes, and, and that worked quite well. We'll just have to see where uh, life takes us here. But um, I know that that we at Arc of Life definitely want to play live and, and show proof of life, which we know is going to be very uh very powerful and and just get this thing going so we'll see what happens there by the way did you produce this album uh pretty much but the band was really involved so it's you know it's produced by all of us and Derek Shulman had a huge hand in it as well Billy when you left home I'm curious I ask this to everyone what was in your record collection approximately right just uh when you left home what were you listening to when you made that big step of leaving uh in my youth you mean yeah, when you left home, when you actually left, Mom and Dad, I'm out of here. Uh, you know, I was at that point in high school, uh, and I was listening to Gentle Giant Civilian, and Asia had just come out, the first Asia record, which was great, and I think Genesis Abacab came out around the same time, and I was sort of, I was still in the prog lane, uh, just discovering these, these new things along the way, but those were the, the uh, of that sort of era, those were the things that I'm, I'm reminded of. We'll have more from Billy Sherwood coming up in a few days. Make sure you comment on our videos, subscribe to our channel, and share our videos. I'm John Bowden from Rocky Stream Music.